I am not my mom, okay? I know. So then why does she matter? Her actions, her words, they don't define me. They influence you. You are Quinn's world. <laughs> and I don't think that I can be a part of it anymore. I'm, I'm, I'm not losing you because of my mother. Hope is with Wyatt right now. If you think she's coming back to you tonight, you're cuckoo crazy. Oh, cuckoo crazy? That's such a compliment coming from you. <laughs> Fine. Be delusional if you want. I just thought you should be prepared. Well, that's sweet. Is that why you came by? Come on, Quinn. The reason you showed up is because you plan on ambushing Hope the minute she walks through my front door. Mm. She's not coming. Quinn, Hope all but committed herself to me tonight. She's finally seeing you and Wyatt clearly, and by the way, she's not the only one. Brooke, Eric, everyone over at Forrester who matters is on to you now. And as soon as the word gets out about what happened to Ridge and your involvement, you and Wyatt are out at Forrester. And more importantly, you're out of Hope's life. Quinn set this whole thing up. Yeah. And all because she wants Bill Spencer. I mean, who in their right mind would want Excuse me, Caroline. Who would want to interrupt such a beautiful wedding between two such obviously happy people? Well, clearly, Quinn has unresolved feelings from back in the day. Crazy. How one picture can cause so much damage. She knew it, too. That's what's so disgusting about this whole thing. She knew exactly how Ridge would react. Used him. Whatever happens to Uncle Ridge, she is responsible. Don't get ahead of yourself. I work at Forrester because of the quality of my jewelry, not because of my sparkling personality. And I'd be very surprised if they fired me because I accidentally emailed a photo to Ridge. Well, human resources might think But right. even if they do, it's not gonna change Hope's feelings for Wyatt. Quinn, why would Hope want anything to do with him now? Oh. Why would she want a man who treats her with respect, who doesn't waffle and bounce from one girl to the other? Guess why would she want a guy like that? Y you, you, you have a very narrow view of me. Oh, I'm sure you have many fascinating sides from rescuing kittens to deep frying tofu in a walk. I mean, I'm sure the party at this house never ends. It doesn't, you can leave anytime you want. Yeah, well, you've seen their connection. You've seen their passion. Hope may have led you to believe that she will be coming back here tonight, words said in anger because of something I did, but after spending some alone time with Wyatt, I'm sorry. She's never going to leave a real man to come back here to a boy like you. I feel like I'm losing you and I can't let that happen. <sighs> Wyatt, you knew that I was gonna make a decision. You knew I wouldn't drag this out forever. So this is decision day? Right after my mom did something horrible? Look, you have waited all this time. You dated both of us, and now you're making a decision based on a reaction. No, that's not what I'm doing. Yes, yes, yes it is. Ridge might be dead because of my mother, not me. This is about more than Ridge. Okay, so forget about our parents. Forget about everyone else. Look me in the eye and tell me you don't love me. You were not ready to walk away from us. What? It's an alert I set the other day before Ridge took off. Racquetball, 7.30 tomorrow. So I remember to pack my gym bag. That's why Ridge and I got more business done there than at the office. They will find him. They better. Did you notice Allie and Oliver? What about them? The way he touched her? Her uncle might be dead. Which might make her very vulnerable. 
You heard the recording on my phone. Oliver saying he's just putting up with her. I remember being her age, young and naive. I was taken advantage of more than once. I don't want to see that happen to Allie. Okay, Dad. Me too. How's Thorne? Worried. He's on his way to Abu Dhabi now, joining the search effort. Is Uncle Rich really gone? You foresters are made tough. If he's anything like you, he's gonna be just fine. I just wish that there was something that we could do, some way we could help. Yeah, I asked my mom if I should head out there. I'm needed here more, she said. Well, with Brooke and Eric gone, you are. Don't wait, Rick. Wait? For your parents to get back. Your president. You can do it yourself. Do what? Fire Quinn. Tonight. You know what's so strange to me, Quinn? Ridge is missing right now. He could be dead because of you. And I can think of a million things that you should be doing. You know, praying, groveling, fleeing the country, to name a few. But instead, you choose to spend your time coming over here and harassing me, trying to make me doubt my relationship with Hope. You have some messed up priorities, lady. Just because I'm not weeping or gnashing my teeth doesn't mean I'm not concerned about Ridge. Oh yeah, do you feel guilty? Do you feel guilty? No. Of course not. People are suffering right now, but you don't care. You have one thing on your mind. Why it must have hope. So go ahead, no, please, belittle me. Try to make me think that hope is staying elsewhere tonight. I know better. I know that your lies are finally catching up to you. I know that this one-track mind of yours is about to bite you in the butt. It's not that I want to walk away from this. Okay, that should tell you something. Yeah, it tells me how much you've meant to me. Don't. Don't do that. Don't want the past tense. I don't want to give it up. But I have to. Because I really can't take it any longer. Everything that your mom has done... Doesn't even matter to us. That's what I'm trying to get you but to it, understand. But it does matter. It really matters because she has such a huge influence on you. Then I'll distance myself. I I'll prove you wrong. I think that maybe you could do that if it were just about her. So it isn't then? No. So then it's me? No, it's, it's me. It's, it's the way that I've changed. The things that I'm justifying. I, I convinced myself that the diamond heist wasn't a big deal. Oh my, okay, this is, this is Allie then. No. Allie's gotten to you, this no. is what this is. No, Wyatt, this has nothing to do with Allie. Yes it is, she's been harping at you and getting inside your head about the diamond No, heist. Wyatt, look, I'm not mad. I'm not, I forgave you and I meant it, I meant that. It's, you know, it's, it's not about the diamond, it's. I don't understand. We had a lot of fun together. And I think that you came into my life at exactly the right time, really when I needed you. But when it comes to settling down and starting a future, you know, when lying comes so easy to you, no, 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 when no. punching Liam is your answer. Like he hasn't hit me before? No, it was different. You were kissing me while, while he and I were engaged. But you didn't want to be. Otherwise, you would have been the one to hit me yourself. All I know is that I've had enough. So much has happened. I mean, Ridge could be dead. What am I supposed to do with that? Wyatt, I'm always gonna care about you. How do you do that? What? Make me feel like it'll be all right. It will. Ridge will come home. Quinn and Wyatt will go away. 
and all will be well for the lovely Miss F. I want Quinn gone as much as you do, Pam. But my father's CEO, and I have to talk to him first. Do you really think that he'd object? Yeah, I mean, especially if Ridge is, you know... Even if everything is fine with Ridge, Quinn needs to be held accountable. Yeah, I was finally starting to think that there was finally a man that she could trust. Well, it sounds like it's less of what Uncle Bill did and more of what Quinn did. I'm telling you, Rick, she's evil. She needs to be out of here. Somebody's feeling all high and mighty. Well, you know, I got the girl, you and Wyatt are done for, so yeah, pretty much. This is all your fault. Excuse me? How do you figure that? You couldn't just go away. Move to Paris, be with Steffi, find somebody new. No, you had to stay here, pining away for hope, persecuting Wyatt every chance you got. She was happy. She moved on. Stop getting in the way. You say these things, but I know you don't mean them. Not by the way that you're looking at me right now. I was dating both of you, and you knew that it could go either way. I knew that it was me. And only me. I knew you'd finally get Liam out of your system. You, you still can. I had to make a decision, Wyatt, and I made the one that I can live with. No. You're settling. No, that's not what I'm saying. Yeah. My mother made an insanely stupid mistake. Unforgivable, but that doesn't mean go running off with Liam. Don't lump everything that I have done in the past with everything my mom has done. We are the, different people. The past? Yes. Wyatt, you just punched Liam a couple hours ago. I know, and I'm sorry about that. I lashed out, but you should have heard the things that he was saying. And I'm saying that I've had enough. Of me? Of my reactions to you. What are your reactions now? And now, don't sacrifice everything that we have built because of a punch or because of my mother. I'm not. I don't believe you. I was confused. Okay, Liam had, had just let me down so many times. And then I came along. A different kind of guy, someone who, who only focused on you. Someone who, who means what he says. What is it about me that scares you? Huh? It can't be a diamond, it can't be a punch or my mother. You love me. Yeah, I do. Okay. But I can trust Liam. And not me. Because of my mother. You know, I confided in you on that trip. About us. About everything that we did to, to, to survive, to make ends meet. Sending Ridge to stop my mother's wedding has absolutely nothing to do with making ends meet. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I know it sounds like I'm blaming you for things that your mother has done, but it's more, it really is more than that. What is it that you think that we have in common? That we, that we both make things happen? Yeah, but is that such a bad thing? You'd rather spend the rest of your life with a guy like Liam? Who, who writes fashion articles in between yoga classes and, and rescues puppies and, and, and saves kittens. And... Those are things that are important to me, Wyatt. Those are things that I enjoy, and I'm glad that I'm with a man who thinks about something other than himself. When I am with Liam, I know exactly what I'm gonna get. That's what I want. That's my future. Thank you. I haven't done anything. Are you kidding? You have been so supportive. Helping me deal with my issues with Taylor and my mom. And now Uncle Ridge is missing and you are right by my side. You make me feel safe. It's all part of the job, ma'am. Seriously though, I'm glad you said that. You are always gonna be safe with me. Yeah, and you never will get it, because you don't understand who Hope is 
or what she stands for. I've seen all the hope for the future billboards, values and principles, blah, blah, blah. It's not difficult to grasp. And yet you don't. And neither does your son. Morality, Quinn, is very important to Hope. Yeah, she was seduced by Wyatt, manipulated by you, but with the kind of integrity she has, I knew it wouldn't be long before she saw you and Wyatt for who you are. And now, it's done. She's ending it right now, freeing herself from Wyatt. And we're gonna be married, and we're gonna have a life together, and this time, Quinn, this time, I'm gonna do everything I can to make sure you can't do a damn thing about it. You are angry, frustrated, confused, scared about Ridge. You blame my mom, and rightfully so, but I can't let you give up on us because of her. I warned her. She's trouble. She's crazy, Wyatt. I, I, I agree. I, I, I've been looking the other way, and I never should have. Because you care about me. Focus on that, on us. I have changed since being with you. Look where we are. Hmm? Th there's a reason why I brought you here. Up to Big Bear, where it all started. Just take a step back. Spend the night here, no. and in the morning it'll all it'll all make sense. It'll no, be clear. No, no, it no, no. So then you stay in the cabin, then. I I'll stay in a tent in the backyard. And in the morning, you can get up, you can snap a picture of me, I can chase you through the woods again. Why? And you'd fall. Like, you know, you'd fall, because, you know, let's face it, you're kind of a klutz like that. And i kiss you. And we could start over. I can't do that. You know, maybe, maybe I made a mistake trying to play it cool with you, not to rush into anything and, and, and not to make a commitment. I wanted to be different than Liam. No pressure, no ultimatums. You know, you needed to see that there was someone out there who could bring out a different side in you. And you did make me see that, and why I wouldn't trade anything that we had. Then don't, don't. You know, what would it mean if you end up with Liam right now? Why would you want to go back to that insecurity? I am offering you complete devotion here. And I know, I, I've made mistakes along the way, mistakes that I have owned up to. And yeah, I got a crazy mom. But have you ever doubted that I couldn't handle her? No. Have you ever wondered if you were my top priority or not? Because I love you. I do. With everything that I am. And I always will. Which is a reason why I brought you here today. <sighs> Say yes. Wife.